In this question we are given that ABCD is a parallelogram. Now remember when something is a parallelogram it automatically means the following. They further tell us that AE is equal to CF so we can see that over here we've got AE equal to CF and BE is equal to DF so BE is equal to DF over there. And so the question is prove that ECDF is a parallelogram. Aha! So this is a good question because remember in a previous video we said that to prove that something is a parallelogram there is five different ways. The first way that you could try is to prove that all sides are parallel and so that would look like this. The second way is the following is to prove that the diagonals bisect so it will look like this over here. The third way is to prove that all sides are equal or all the opposite sides are equal so we'll say here up sides equal. The fourth way is to show that all opposite angles are equal. So opposite angles are equal. And the last way is to do the following, is to prove that the opposite sides, just one pair, is equal and parallel. So one pair, opposite sides equal and parallel. If you can find any one of those five categories, then it is a parallelogram. So let's go see what we have. Well, we know that the green ABCD is a parallelogram, and so automatically we can use these over here. So we know that its diagonals bisect each other, so we can say that AE is equal to ED, and the reason for that will just be diags, meaning diagonals, of a parallelogram. Okay, so we can instantly do that over there. Now have a look here. We can straight away see that ED is the same as CF. Okay, so we've just proved that one of the sides or one pair of sides is equal. Now we can also look at this over here where we can say that BE is going to be the same as EC, right? Because they are part of the parallelogram and they are on the diagonal. And we know that the diagonals bisect, and so these two halves have to be the same. And then these two halves have to be the same. And so that can also be diags for diagonals of a parallelogram. So look what we've just done. In this um, quadrilateral over here, we have just shown that the opposite sides are equal in length. And that's this one over here. The third option, if the opposite sides of if the opposite sides are equal, then we can say it's a parallelogram. So what we can do is we can say therefore say that E D C F is a parallelogram. And the reason for that is that the opposite sides of the quadrilateral, we can't call it a parallelogram, we'll say that the opposite sides of the quadrilateral are equal.